session or not. You ugly bitch. Um. Um. The Master Chief Saga. It's normal difficulty, so let's see if we can get through and get all the part times. You fucking whore, yeah. No, but, like, but you know, there's an achie there's achievements and unlockables and shit for doing the Master Chief saga. Yeah. It's. Well, that's all point, look. And the thing is, I was thinking then as well, like we could do eventually, just to get all the playlists done, we could do the easy playlists, and in those playlists we could like get, you know, the skulls, terminals, random shit like that. And then like for legendary we could try like pair scores, I suppose, or heroic maybe. <laughs> I love just smacking your man in the face and walking on. It's funny how that was the first time that the shield was down. Okay, this is the challenge, Dave. In this playthrough, we're not allowed to stop moving. Like, even if you need to wait for something to happen, you still have to run around little circles. Shit getting in my way. I know, yeah. Warning, blast doors closing. We have to use the ship's maintenance access ways. Follow the nav. <laughs> I 
Actually, that reminds me. Um, during the week was the first time I've ever watched. Um, during the week was the first time I ever watched Cat in the Hot and Roof. Or Fiddler on the Roof, sorry. But in fairness, you have to admit, that movie has nothing got to do with a fiddler on a roof. Looks like the Covenant wanted to kiss you. Ah, well, there is a couple of fiddlers on the roof. But the fact the fact that, like, you know, it's all about a Jewish dude trying to sell away his daughters and all that sort of shit, like... Well, he says that he loves them and he wants them to get married, but actually he just wants to sell them. Five minutes twenty eight. Jesus. I know I am. Chief? Hopefully Chief, the nuns no won't go in reverse. At last. Are you all right? I mean, wait, what? Can you move? The others. The There's nothing we can Reversing nuns, but warning. I detected multiple Covenant dropships on approach. We watched a film last night, actually, it was fucking brilliant. The Covenant will believe that everyone um, afterwards, it was called, um, The Helpers. Covenant dropship inbound. It's fucking brilliant. There was one bit in it. Like, I'm not going to explain anything about what happens in the storyline. Like, like, the reasons for shit and stuff like that, I'm not going to explain. But basically, this crowd, um, go to, uh, draw a road trip going to Las Vegas. And they get a couple of flat tires and they find this like random motel. So uh they go in and it's like, you know, they the crowd inside the motel said, you know, they'll fix the tires free of charge, they'll give them a free place to stay, you know, drinks are on them, you know, all that sort of shit. Um you know, they're being proper, you know, southern friendly kind of fucking people like and randomly, they, like they're drinking and fucking and everything, like. But the following day, when they, when a couple of them wake up, there's one fella. He seems to be a bit slow, but he can't see has a camera with him. And he goes to wake up his friends, and his friends wake up or whatever. And just as he's walking out the door, the one of the people the that owned the motel just come along with a machete fine. and just one shot his head straight off his neck. And you're one then, one of the girls they. The, the one inside the bedroom like you know, she's like oh my god what the fuck are you doing and your man that chops off your one's head Kelly couldn't stop laughing like your man that chopped off your man's head just goes oh Jesus I'm sorry what's wrong <laughs> <laughs> just as if everything's perfectly normal like and then one of the other women now owns the place comes along and she's like um She's like, oh gosh darn it, now I owe him 20 bucks. I thought he'd take him more than one slash. <laughs> it's fucking brilliant. I'm at the first dropship. Look how shiny the dropship is in the new graphics compared to the old one, like. Like the old one, there's shininess painted on, do you know what I mean? And in the new one, there's actual, you know, reflective textures.
Yo, we need to do one of these days. I mean, when we're doing the easy, um, the easy playthroughs, we'll need to do where it's like fucking um, melee only or some shit like that. Oh yeah. So when is that year one shit and all that coming out? To be honest, yeah, I'd even be happy with a fucking the like EA Access subscription or some shit like that. <laughs> yeah, that be handy actually. Mine's running out next month. Two days time, isn't it? And there's probably, like, the thing is I have a fucking two-day one as well here hanging around from the time I bought the second controller, if you need it. There's just more than likely one with Destiny and, you know, any multiplayer game usually has a trial with it. Stop shooting, mate! You check if the stream is up. Did you get that? Did you get that alert saying Melamphy is broadcasting? Look, more uh, it should be up, so. Coming in fast. If those lifeboats make it down, the Covenant are going to be right on top of them. Where's Fall Hammer? Oh, there she is. Hey, Limes. Um, it must have been after I started streaming, cause uh, like the I have like ninety percent of the notifications turned off while I'm streaming. Like the Skype call notifications turned off, but if you send a message, I would have gotten that. You know what I mean? No, but sorry if there was any confusion as well, Kyle. It was just it's just it's been a weird couple of days and. There's been a bunch of shit happening with like some people, so I was just making sure everything was cool. Ah ah ah! And you fucking bitch! Look as you're weighing down the fucking warhog again, Dave. Well, it can accept my fucking. 20 or 30 stone at the front, they can't accept yours at the back. <laughs> Man, you fucking. Reds. That's because I'm over here with you.
I did, there's no reason for me to be shooting at you. I was just shooting you anyway. Um, everything's cool. Just been crazy. Fair enough, dude. No, it's good to hear that everything's okay, man. Fucking, uh, I was just a bit worried, like. There's new traffic on the Covenant Battle Network. <laughs> a lot more crew made it off the autumn than I had predicted. The captain really gave them hell. <laughs> we can find Captain Hughes and the other survivors. We have a chance to coordinate an effective resistance. There was some crazy prick, do you know that? I don't. No, I really don't because because whatever I'm like co oping with people then as well they're able to get the full fucking multiplayer experience where they where they're not fucking censored or any shit like that. Like you know yourself, Dave, whenever I'm not streaming, I'm a bit of a fucking crackpot on chat like. Well, whenever I'm in a good mood anyway. Gaff to myself, gonna be fucking earning some more fucking accreditation starting next week. The only downside is that I have to fucking force my child into a church that no one wants anyone to ever be a part of. No, but we need to do that so that she can um, get into school. Yeah. It's just, it's still kind of like the old system in a small way over here. Um, you need to be, you need to be baptized to get into a good school over here. About time you showed up. There we go. So when you get a Master Chief Collection, airlines, eh? Huh? Huh? Eh? Eh? Huh? Because if you and your brother get it, the four of us will be able to play. We can have a four-way circle jerk. Then no one's hands will be called, I mean what? I like that now as well though, the way that it keeps, um, when it goes on sale, John has it. Oh, did he get the disc version? Ah, oh, fuck off, you bastard. If I knew the John had it, I would have fucking invited him into games. That's me, you prick. You're some prick. Yeah, and I was I was trying to get into fucking melee, and but you kept shooting. Yeah. I killed the grunt, and then you kept shooting in my general direction, and then I died. You know what? No. Well, that's what you get. Echo 419 to Cortana, come in. We read you, Echo 419. We have survivors and need immediate dust off. Roger, Cortana. On my way. I spotted additional lifeboats in your area. One near the cliff edge. 
I thought you would have gotten the done the whole fucking digital copy shit again. Yeah. Do you mean the south of Ireland? No, like. Yeah. No, but I I did know if you ran about like the south of Ireland or like something in the map in Halo or what, like. By about a fiver. Like. Actually, no. No, they're roughly the same. It depends on the game, really. Because when the likes of Destiny and that came out, that was. On disc, it was 75. Whereas if I was to get it on digital, it would have been 70. Do you know what I mean? Whereas, like, on digital, no, most of them are 70, whereas in GameStop, some of them are 65, some of them are 75. See those things moving around, shooting at us? Those are things you should be aiming at. Right in front of us. Discs are cheaper in Canada than they are digital. Because they're taking out the um, they're taking out the middleman for you. They're taking out the need to like someone's asked that question before, and the explanation I was given, I think it was to I think it was by Sony at the time. Um, I can't remember. Yeah, it was Sony at the time because it was um, the PlayStation Network. Um, the reasoning that they were giving was the fact that you don't have to get up off your ass and go to the shop pick up a disc you know go back to your console and put the disc into the console so they reckon that it's worth an extra fiver to them for taking out that convenience for you or giving you that convenience sorry ow Go down inside the temple. We should and the boxes the and send them out and... I know what you mean. <laughs> Man. Jesus Christ. They're going to have to, and I mean both Sony and Microsoft, and to a certain extent Nintendo also, all of them are going to need to fucking reduce all of their prices by at least half if they're going to be able to fucking um, in any way compete with um, Valve once the Steam box comes out. Hey!
traffic on the Covenant battle net. I found Captain ah. Covenant Cruiser, the Truth and Reconciliation, a ship I disabled before we abandoned the Autumn. The Truth and Reconciliation touched down on a desert plateau roughly 300 kilometers upstream. Hey. I'm about to die, man. Seriously. There's our ride. Get aboard and let's get out of here. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Ready for dust off. Achievement unlocked. I got this. <laughs> Probably power time. Oh, I didn't. Every time we did it, we were about five seconds over. Unless that was for fuck. Unless I'm wrong, no, that was for medals or kills or something. Once we get inside the ship, I should be able to lock on to the tracking signal from Captain Key's neural implants. Hit him, Marines! Go, go, go! The core ain't paying us by the hour! Stick to the higher ground to the right. How can you lick something with your titties? Without being spotted. I've detected Covenant stationary guns near the next pass. I recommend using your sniper rifle to take out the gun while I call the Marines. That's fucked up, dude. <laughs> apparently, like, apparently, Kyle wants burritos. Avenge me life, Ray. Do you fuck? Why are so good about burritos anyway? Never had them. I'm Irish, dude. We don't have burritos. Oh, oh. So I'm just gonna get out of my house and go to like America or Mexico or something and get a burrito, yeah? No. There's kebab places, not burrito places. That's it, Dave's cancelling his trip to Cork. I, I've never... You really need to stop. You need to stop describing it like that. For fuck's sake. <laughs> Kyle, would you say that a burrito is like being sodomized in the face by an angel and it came all over your face and mouth? Because that's basically what Dave is saying, but it was a lot more long-winded than that. Yeah, there's no burrito places in Cork, as far as I'm aware. I've never had them, look. Like. Alert! Covenant dropships are inbound. Because we have kebab places, dude. 
but they're not the old type of kebabs. So they're not the kebabs with the shitty bread, or, or where it's like a pancake. They're kebabs with nan bread. Like, nan bread kebabs, they're the best thing ever. What are you on about? I'm, I've been alive the whole time. No, I would have told you if I went down, dude. I'm up at the very end sniping out the fucking... the dudes. <laughs> oh man, no, I want to watch Batman. You've watched Batman way too much. It's just hard to think that new Alfred was once um, Austin Powers' dad. Like in his younger years, he was the father to the international man of mystery. And then in his later years, he was the butler to Bruce Wayne. What do you mean? What the fuck are you on about? Oh, I didn't watch that. Stop shooting me! You seriously need to fucking... Uh. I can't have that from a beautiful character. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I had no choice. You're gonna sit in my face and tell me that you love me. <laughs> Checkpoint. Sit in my face and tell me that you love me. Sit in my face and tell me that you do. One down. Two down. Cortana to Echo 419. You're down. We've reached the gravity lift and are ready for reinforcements. Copy that, Cortana. Hold <laughs> tight, gentlemen. Full hammer out. Once we're inside the ship, I can home in on the captain's command neural interface. We'll probably be in or near the ship's brig, which should narrow our search. Why, you've done a fuckload of damage to the staff. But the funny thing is, you didn't even try to take the sniper rifle. Go, go, go. Yeah, because it didn't fucking die yet. The funny thing is that the only times I've died so far in this campaign is where you kill me. Over here. I killed him. They won't mess with us again. 
Ja. Uh. Run away! <laughs> Do you hear what the ringtone is whenever Kelly rings me? Hello? Yeah, yeah Grand just one hand haloing at the moment. Streaming it, playing with Dave, like. Fair enough. No, you're not allowed to come home. But, tell you, come back whenever the fuck you want to, like. You're the one who decided to go away, do you know what I mean? You're the one who decided to go away, it's up to you when you come back. I literally only started, but fuck it, like. Hmm? No, I'm getting pissed off at people. I'll tell you when I come back, or when you come back. No. Alright. Um, why are you planning on doing so? Is your mom or Darren still there? Ask her to come over here so they don't have to fucking come over the stairs. Uh, of course not. What? Alright. Wait, that's the locked door down there. Nah, nah, just give me a text when you're downstairs or whatever. Controls to open it must be somewhere in this room. Alright, should I talk to her as well? Okay. All right. Sorry about that. Sorry. I just got shot on the way home there, no. I don't fucking get it, look. Oh dear. Never mind. Before the door closes. Yes. Now we don't have to clear with the rest of them. You just so happened to spawn at the other side of the room.
on it. I'd like to see you crack a 28,000 bit modulating encryption key. Dance, hunter, dance. Got it. I like that little strategy. I'll fucking lock you when you close. You scantily clad bitch, yeah. You always run down that way, like. But wait a minute, aren't burritos basically just kebabs with beans? Wrong way. Oh, take the sniper rifle, there you. Like, since you don't have the achievement left. Get out my fucking way, you stupid spastic. look like holding cells. There are probably multiple detention stations. The captain must be in one of them. We need to keep looking for him. There we go. We should head back to the shuttle bay and call for evac.
I'm down. We made it. Cortana to Echo 419. We have the captain and need extraction. It's not a bad thing anyway, at least now I have a fucking uh, full pla uh, saw rifle again. And I'm having a tough time shaking them. You'll be better off finding your own ride. Sorry. Acknowledged, Foe Hammer. Cortana out. Air support is cut off, Captain. We need to hold here until she can move in. Oh, man. We're trapped in here! We're screwed! We're screwed, man! Stow the belly again, soldier. Remember you You keep an eye on keys, I'll go and press the button. You and the chief can get us into one of those covenant dropships. I can fly us out of here. Yes, Captain. There's a covenant dropship still docked. Oh, no, no. Good job. Good fucking job. You're never babysitting Naomi, I swear to god. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Because he's a captain. We have the captain and need extraction on the double. Negative Cortana, I've been engaged by Covenant Air Patrols and I'm having a tough time shaking them. You'll be better off finding your own ride. Sorry. Acknowledged, Foe Hammer. Cortana out. Air support is cut off, Captain. Yeah, I'm smacking the red button. Oh man, we're trapped in here. We're screwed. We're screwed, man. Show the way again, soldier. Remember, you're a leatherneck. Cortana. There's no red button on the door. Then the old version, like. I can fly us out of here. Yes, Captain. There's a Covenant dropship still docked. Dave. Seriously, like. Oh my god, the sword guys are so much easier to see in all graphics. The sword sticks out like a fucking ass. We um we're over pair, so there's no reason for the timer to be there. Need to hold here until she can move in. Oh man, we're trapped in here. We're screwed. We're screwed, man. Stow the belly again, soldier. Remember you're our left man. Cortana, if you and the chief can get us into one of those Covenant dropships, I can fly us out of here. Yes, Captain. There's a Covenant dropship. Even the player indicator is bigger in the fucking new graphics. No. It kind of feels like Chief is like shorter as well in the new graphic or in the old graphics. Like it kind of looks like you're closer to the ground. Did you see the what the way the screen was going white right there? That was the ending sequence about the start. Ah, fuck him! Silent cartographer, huh? What? The one for the sniper rifle. The Covenant believe that what they call the silent. I swear to God, man, I'm getting addicted to fucking chewing gum. 
the cartographer is a map room to lead us to his yeah. control center. I'm all facts, goblin is no look. Installations. One of them contains the map room. Yes. Oh, I'm after going off in another direction. Did the game just restart for you? We're desynchronized. I restarted the level. What they call the silent cartographer is somewhere under this island. The cartographer is a map room to lead us to Halo's control center. Yeah. Connection lost, you would be disconnected. It'd be handy if I wasn't in a cutscene and I was allowed to fucking save and quit myself, like. It was like, you will be disconnected in three seconds, and then it quit. <laughs> New name player. Oh yeah, fuck it. Tell me when you're joined in. Lovely. <laughs> I'm so fucking rich I shit out bank statements but... Actually, that reminds me, I got my new fucking debit card there two or three days ago. Fucking, uh, my current one was running out next month, like. I not believe that what they call the silent cartographer is somewhere under this island. The cartographer is a map room that will lead us to Halo's control center. The island has multiple structures and installations. One of them contains the map room. You should be able to. Weird. You have move around now. I got sticky. Leave that marine alone, for fuck's sake. You won't be able to because you're in the battle, like. There we go. Oh my god, they added some islands. I want to test something. Okay, let's move out. Let's go find the map room that will show us the location of Halo's control center. Looks like 
there is a path into the interior of the island. Grab an overshield and run. This isn't the map room. Analyzing. This is a security override station for the main facility, located somewhere else on this island. Shut the system down so the Covenant won't be able to lock us out. We should now have access to the main facility. Let's find the map room. Mayday! Mayday! Dropship Bravo 22! Shoot me once or twice there, will ya? Yep, perfect. I just wanted the I want I only had a tiny bit of overshield so I wanted to have no overshield so I can pick up another one. So that I can do this. After I saw we were up against hunters, I thought you could use them. Let's move down the beach. Keep an eye out for any cargo we can salvage. See, wasn't that faster than no look. I want to think for this one 15 minutes. We definitely have this. Uh, it, the bits of the one of Hunters, yeah. Just stay in the car, alright? Don't shoot, stop shooting, stop shooting. Jump up. The Covenant are putting up a real fight. The cartographer that turning in is actually hard enough to do. Analysis indicates that the map room should be at the bottom floor of this facility. Let's keep going. It's very inside. precise. Like, don't shoot here in the water, alright? You get an extra couple of seconds of no fucking shooting, like. Here we go, I'm down the bottom floor. I dropped off the site, no, but you drop off a certain part of the site, and there's a small bit of the, uh, there's a bit of platform that you're not supposed to be able to reach, and you can use that as a kind of a middle platform.
better off just going around this way to kind of get them all away from the ramp. Or else you just go straight up the ramp. <laughs> <coughs> I have the rocket launch you know, here for when we come across the hunters. And for little moments like that. See, this is where I landed when I dropped down. Do that little outside that we were just at there. Yeah, I'm down. I kind of shot a rocket a bit too early and hit myself. No, they were a bit too close to me, do you know what I mean? See that's the thing, if you're if you do this with the Warhog, the hunters will constantly try to dodge you, so they won't have a chance to shoot you. Ow, get into the pelican. <laughs> that's the thing I got killed. Or do you know what? Stay out of the pelican or oh, okay. Bitch. Okay, I'm out. Get in, get in. Perfect. See what I mean though? It's like, it's kind of, unless you're on a higher difficulty, you kind of have to go for par score or par time. You can't go for both at the same time. Because in a lot of cases, to get the par, the par time, you have to skip a fuck ton of fights. I'll fuck you so far, Hammer. Alright, let's go for part time here as well, which is 15 minutes. No, you're not. Interesting. 
You still don't. Patterns here seem natural, not artificial. I wonder if the ring's environment systems are malfunctioning, or if the designers wanted the installation to have inclement weather. This is Fire Team Zulu requesting immediate assistance from any UNSC forces. Does anyone copy? Over. I didn't think there were any human forces left on this part of the ring. Cortana to Fire Team Zulu. I read you. Fire Team Zulu, this is Cortana. Hold position. We're on our way. Roger that. Make it quick. Lovely. Ah, what? No, fuck that. We need that fucking minute, like. There's about three levels in each game. Two or three levels where, you, where every second counts, like. Keep going, I have to open the door there. Interesting. The weather patterns here seem natural, not artificial. I wonder if the ring's environment systems are malfunctioning. Or if the designers wanted the installation to have inclement weather. This is Fire Team Zulu requesting immediate assistance from any UNSC forces. Does anyone copy? Over. I didn't think there were any human forces left on this part of the ring. Cortana to Fire Team Zulu. I read you. Fire Team Zulu, this is Cortana. Hold position. We're on our way. Roger that. Make it quick.
Covenant placed their tanks to defend the entrance to the tunnel.
Well, just be good. Get back to the bedroom. Oh, she's a great girl. It'd be a very good girl. You don't give me a kiss. Sorry about that. How far up are you gone? Fuck it, we'll, we'll restart this off. No, sorry about that. It's just fucking my mom and dad called down and then. Just my mom and dad decided to go away. Kelly came back with Naomi, so my mom and dad decided to stay longer. And no, we don't want to fucking play games, lad.
interesting. The weather patterns here seem natural, not artificial. I wonder if the game's environment systems are malfunctioning. Or if the designers want to have weather. Commanding, request immediate assistance from any UN entity. Copy that. I didn't think there were any forces left. Cortana to fire team Zulu. I read you. Fire team Zulu, this is Cortana. Hold position. We're on our way. Roger that. Make it quick. The weather patterns here seem with a fedora. I wonder if Why a fedora? Systems are malfunctioning. Or if the designers are malfunctioning. Fedora is Fedora's going to be fair, no, though, dude, don't think. You dorky bitch. Cortana to Fire Team Zulu. I read you. Fire Team Zulu, this is Cortana. Hold position. We're on our way. That was a full clip. There we go. He's dead. Who's <laughs> wearing a fedora as MLG? Remember on Legendary when there was fucking hunters in these corridors. I think it's funny that if you try to go off the end like this, it actually stops you. Melee. I'm probably going to head to bed in a few, just need to rest work, I still my ass off, and those six down the dress off here. Fuck! Well, man, at least you're walking away, dude. Oh, shit. No! That hurts. That teleport, though. Holidays and shit get as busy especially all these Amazon packages. I suppose actually, yeah. Go you crazy bitch. No, not you. <laughs> Kelly Todd was talking to her there. I just wanted to get off the phone. You know I don't like being on the phone a long time. I kind of did. Yeah. Well, no. The first thing you rang me, I was really pissed off over that shit that happened earlier. And then the second time you rang me, it was um, I just wanted to get on with gaming. Because you were like, you know, oh, are you enjoying your time with Halo? And I was on it for like 10 minutes. He thought I was talking to you as well. <laughs> well, see, this is what I mean. When you're in a good mood, you're OP at games. Do you know what I mean? Just in general, it's like we're fucking breezing through this. Ah! I take that back. I think it's retarded that if you're in a warhog and they shoot the warhog, it counts as damage towards you. Get in, get in, get in, get in.
No, it comes to damage towards you. So like if they shoot the rear tail light. Like there now, he hit the fucking the back of the car and it got rid of my shield. By the way, Destiny is getting better and better every morning I play it. Oh. I, I jumped onto the demo of it, like there was a trial at the moment of Destiny up, and I got it for the laugh, just to see, and meh. The fuck do you be on about, like? Actually, <laughs> that was brilliant there. Fucking Kelly like poked her ass out so that like you could see it if you're looking at the stream. And the second she put her ass away, the leaf just went ah. Don't take away the ass! Arr! Better as well in the story to do as my first. Oh fuck it! Yeah, if it's your first time playing it, it's fucking brilliant, especially the storyline. But like it was personal reasons that I gave it up, and I was only saying to Dave there earlier, Kelly, like, I'd be half tempted to play it again because I know I'd fucking be able to keep a lid on a lid on it, like. Because the thing is, it's not as if I'm going to be fucking making huge raid parties and shit like that. Because I stopped playing it because of um, MMO addiction, Andres. Like, I used to be a horrible sufferer of MMO addiction back in the, the World of Warcraft days. And, uh, just, no. Do you know what I mean? You're some dick. What the? Do you know how much I fucking hate you? some prick like you you clicked it like three or four times and it made me fall through the ground and die twice so my rocket launcher and shit is gone now it brought it down and then put it back up and then put it back down and then put it back up but then that made me phase through it because it was going up and down too much Doesn't matter. Oh no, it'd be different. It, no, that's the thing. It'd be different if you knew it was gonna happen. Do you know what I mean? If you were doing it just to be a cunt, then yeah, I'd be, I'd be pissed off. Like, oh shit! No, I just opened a door and there's like everything had a needler. Everything and their mother had a needler. I swear to god, I fucking hate needlers. There's actually no need for me. How in the name of fuck did I survive that? That whole time I had no shield and one piece of health. But yeah, Andres, it is a very good game until, like, like just don't leave it consume you. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know you. you like, I don't know if you were, 
if you were ever a World of Warcraft player or Guild Wars or Rift or any of them. But MMO addiction really can hit with that game. Ah well, since you're able to do that, then no, that means you're grand. But with me, it was like... Me and the lads would be like, okay, we'll go on and we'll do, um... We'll do one or two strikes. All of a sudden, it's like... 12 hours later. Yeah, it's like it's like 11 or 12 hours later, and you're thinking to yourself, you know, what the fuck am I doing with my life? And one thing that I think was the main reason that it hit, it hit me really fast and really hard was the fact that I did the 24 hour stream with it. Because then I basically, I basically invoked the demon, like. That's the thing, I didn't, I was only doing it thinking that it wasn't that much of a fucking MMO, like. Just keep running. I know what you mean, actually, I fucking hate when people are like that. Like, fair enough, if their reasons for hating a game are justified fuck are justified but when people are just like no I hate I hate Halo because it's not Resident Evil I actually saw um I actually saw Lord Rage was online there, uh, was a guest there the day before, but he was playing, um, he was playing the original Diablo. It's in front of the TV. Every day now I play a bit of Destiny and a bit of GTA 5 before. Oh fuck it, Josh, you're working away now. Fucking hell, how are you getting on with that, by the way? We're not going to make time on this, by the way. Diablo 1, if some ass had told me that Destiny sucks and it's all about Diablo 1, you should have broke bandwagon. No way, it's because I don't know how much I'm digging the game. But that's thing, it is an awesome game. Just be careful. With great MMO, it becomes great, it becomes great responsibility.
controls work for me, you asked? Yeah. Why would mayonnaise come with great responsibility? Fair enough if it's man mayonnaise, but not not fucking not condiments. What if you have lactose free mayonnaise? So you didn't fucking think of that. Lactose free mayonnaise intolerant. Well fucking done. You should commandeer one of those ghosts. We're going to need the firepower. What are you doing? Not good enough paycheck hours, but also more for friends. What are you doing, dude? Man, I'm getting fucking raped here, like. What was that for? Oh, I just got it. You told me the last day that when you got the job of where you got it, dude. You could have finished the level there, like. You always get too cocky. You just love to get cocky so that people can say that you got cocky. Yeah, basically you just love cock. That was from Kelly, by the way, not me. You loves Kelly's cock. No, Kelly, everyone doesn't love it. There's no such thing as normal people then. Kelly's broke worst, is it? Fuck! Fuck you, stop laughing at me. Look at you dodging all them needles. Oh, the last one hit you, your shit. Get in the ghost! Get in the ghost and just bait yourself down that fucking corridor. Like it's fucking Helen Keller or something like that. There we go. Nah. Did you ever hear that song actually did? About Helen Keller being the perfect woman. You should look it up.
he would perfectly connect with that then. Okay, Andres. What are you doing, man? Oh my fucking way, you super jackal. Is it a jackal? It's a jackal. Jackal. Is it a jackal? Is it a jackal? Is it a jackal? Is it a jackal? A jackal. It's a fucking jackal. Is it a jackal? It's a jackal. Is it a jackal? A fucking jackal. Is it a jackal? Dave, is it a jackal? It's a jackal. I knew you would say ejaculation, like. I fucking knew it, like. Ejaculation. Do I want to get a full time job so I can get you an IPC so we can play some more? No, I am never touching World of Warcraft again. I wouldn't say no to a PC, but I would say no to WoW. I gave that shit up because I got sick of it after working for Blizzard Entertainment. I've seen the I've seen the dark side of the dark side of WoW. And I don't want to see it again. It's kind of like... It's kind of like how gaming gets slightly ruined after you learn programming and you learn how gaming works. When you work for Blizzard, you see some of the fucking... You see behind the smoke and mirrors, basically. And it just ruins it for you. I can play Diablo 3. I don't say no to that. A uh, man, anyway, fucking hell, you wouldn't need to fucking get me a PC at all. Jesus. was. Roy right, wasn't it? No, I didn't see which way you went, I was wondering. And then there's a door over here. Up onto this thingy like a fucking stair. Oh yeah, and Dave, I found out as well. Tomorrow night, or not tomorrow night? Sorry, Saturday night. Um, do you remember the way I was saying I'll be doing a drunken stream and such? It might go a lot better than I fucking thought it was going to. Where the fuck are we? Oh, there we go. Because, um. My parents were saying they were going to take Naomi at the end of the month for, you know, the weekend that you were saying you were going to come down. But now they're saying that if all comes all, they'll take her um, the night of the christening. So, if we're playing Drunken Halo this Saturday night, Kelly's probably going to join in with a few drinks and some Halo as well. Sorry, man.
Fair play. No, if we figure out if Halo 3 is 4 player as well, and then if it is, just play a bit of Halo 3 and Halo 4. And if we can find one more person, you know, well and good, because we have to do 4 player multiplayer then, like. Or even if you get Trish in on it or something. Oh, shit. Naomi. Seriously, like, what in the name of fuck? I can't jump. Seriously, like. What in the name of fuck was that? I could, but like, even with doing crouch jumping, I couldn't get up that fucking ledge. What are you saying, girl? There we go, I'll go up this time. You really like Blizzard games though, do you, Andres? Sorry, I was just trying to get out as fast as possible. Oh, I pressed the bridge lock. Ah, fuck you. Just one with Diablo. I have to admit though, out of all the different war, uh, Blizzard games, I did enjoy StarCraft too. What are you saying, Carl? What are you saying? No, Kelly, I won't hush my guns. <laughs> 